Celtic manager Ange Postacoglu says the Old Firm Derby in Australia will help grow the game in Scotland. Giovanni Van Bronckhorst has also given his backing to the Sydney Super Cup. But as Ronnie Charters now reports, the backlash from supporters continues. The messages from the terraces are clear. The prospect of an Old Firm friendly down under, widely condemned by both sets of supporters. Giovanni Van Bronckhorst, though, says it's a huge opportunity for Rangers, with Celtic boss Ange Postacoglu saying it's a chance to grow the game. We are an all-inclusive church, mate, you know, and, and we, should, we should welcome from far and wide, which we do, and I think taking the team to that side of the world, I think, is positive for us, but also, like I said, Scottish football, because, you know, people know what I'm like. I'm not going to go there and treat it as a friendly. We're going to go there and play a couple of games, and I wanted them to see us playing fantastic football and everyone talking about our football club. Before last night's match, both Celtic and St Mirren came together to send a strong message over Russia's invasion of Ukraine. After a goal this first half, Celtic struck twice after the break through Cameron Carter-Vickers and Callum McGregor. For St Mirren, they dropped to ninth, but just four points of Livingston in fourth. There's the perception that somebody's having an unbelievable season, they're having an awful season. There's, as you say, there's three, four points between the whole thing. Um, and it's up to us now, the next four games, to try and get at least two wins out of the next four, and then it'll put us right back in the mix again. Meanwhile, Rangers got their first away league win in four with a 1-0 victory over St Johnston. The goal coming early through Glenn Kamara to keep up the pace with their title rivals. You know, we tried to score the goals. I don't think we gave any chances away throughout the whole game, which is uh, which I'm very pleased of. But, you know, this game uh, was more about, uh, you know, fighting and, and, and making the duels because playing uh, playing football in this pitch was, uh, was really hard. Next up for Rangers is the visit of Aberdeen on Saturday before Celtic head to Livingston on Sunday. Ronnie Charters, STV News. Well, ahead of Celtic's trip to Livingston, David Martindale believes the league leaders will have a point to prove after they lost at Almondvale earlier in the season. Livy moved up to fourth in the table after their 2-1 win over Dundee United last night. I think there's probably a wee bit of needle in there tying the respect that the Celtic players are coming here trying to rectify the last result and I do believe they're top class international footballers and they'll have a point to prove. But again, we'll be going out there with a point to prove as well. So it should be a good encounter. Hopefully we can get something from the game.